Hello, this is Jess, and this is a recap, uh, day 269, September 25th, Friday, um, moving right along, uh, just dealing with the weather, it's been off and on, cloudy, sunny, it's cooling down, so we're definitely into the, the uh, fall weather, so that's been a good thing. Um, so we're going to move on from that, just doing the daily chores, getting this done, and, uh, enjoying it. Um, here we are, all this stuff's going on, pushing forward with elections, people are acting crazy. Um, the attitudes of folks are gearing up for the unknown, seems like. Um, just have a lot of potential for each of us to look inside ourselves and to uh, put forth a positive um, positive message from yourself somehow. You don't have to say any words, just smile. Uh, feel joy somehow, dig deep, whatever you got to do on that, um, and be kind to other people, especially now, uh, as the unknown is, is uh, scary for most people when it comes to what they're going to do, you know, if everything collapses, um, society could break down, um, it's happening here in, in a lot of ways. Hopefully the fabric will, the fabric that, of the society itself can can hold tight and uh, keep everything at a <clears throat> at a reasonable uh, at a reasonable um, I don't know what the right word is. I'm trying to think here. <clears throat> it's just if we look at ourselves as individuals you know that's a great uh, place to start is working on yourself but at some point if you're going to have any kind of society um, we have to be able to unite as people and uh, all the politics aside and all the the stereotypes and all the hatred um, can slowly be eroded and eliminated. That's just what I think would happen if if we really just decided today I'm going to be kind. I'm not going to uh, let others decide how I'm going to feel about a situation, but instead focus on myself and improving that, and therefore I can be an example maybe to others to uh, do the same and before you know it you have this simple th kindness you know spreading um, infecting the the hatred um, affecting the hatred as well so I think it's worth a try I think it's something that can be uh, achieved with practice not just today not tomorrow maybe a lifelong practice of Promoting kindness, happiness, joy, instead of hatred, and greed, and uh, the things that um, harm ourselves as well as others in the process of achieving those traits. Uh, so if we can eliminate greed and learn how to give without nothing expected in return, yeah, these are all unbelievably hard things for people. Um, but practice is what it takes, I believe. Anyway, this is Jess. I'm gone.